Good morning. I'm going to show you today how you can create exciting AI animations that you can use on your websites like this and this just using this. <laughs> Let's get into it. So the app I'm going to use for this is called Motion Leap and it's absolutely fantastic. There's a free version and a pro version and you can download it on Google Play and also on the iPhone App Store. So let's load up the app. The first thing we're going to do is put our text prompt in. I'm going to search for a sailing boat on a calm ocean, white fluffy clouds, lighthouse in the background, painted by Edward Hopper. At this point you get to choose the style of photo or not to choose a style. Then it will go away and generate your artwork. You can either use that or regenerate it, which I've done here. Now you top right you click on edit and now you can do your stuff. So I'm going to start by clicking the animate button on the left and I'm going to start by selecting the ocean here with my paintbrush and this is the area that I want to animate. Now you can also zoom in at this point to be more precise. I'm not being very precise in this demo, but you select the area you want to animate and then you click on the direction button and then you choose the direction and there we go. We've got a lovely sea animated now. How cool is that? Next up, you can also choose some different options, different effects, one of those being sky. So with a simple click, you can add a beautiful animated sky onto your scene. But you've got some other options as well. Next we're going to click on effects. You can add these little effects onto your photos. This is a winter sparkle effect. It really looks very elegant. But you've got a whole host of other effects like this one that you can play with to create your animated video. In this example I'm adding a flock of birds to my scene. You can also position them and rotate them and you see how they fly in and out of my scene very naturally. In this final example, I'm going to add another effect, this time some fire, which isn't very appropriate for an ocean scene, but it just shows you what's possible. In this case, I'm going to overlay on top of my boat so my boat's on fire. If you're not happy with any element, then you can just delete it like I'm going to do here. Now it's time to export it so we can use it on our website. So just click export. Now we have some options so you can choose the proportions, original 169, one to one or three, four. I would change the duration down to six seconds because you're going to loop this on your actual website and we want the quality to be 4K ideally. Now I'm just going to airdrop that file to my main iMac. Next up, I'm going to compress the video because even though it's only six seconds, it will still be about 10 megabytes and we can get it smaller. Here we go. This one is actually 10.3 megabytes. There is a great website which you can compress your videos for free called v.io. I will put a link for you in the description. You just drag your file across here and it will upload it and then it'll compress it for you. And you can see here on the left that my compressed size is now 1.6 to 3 megabytes. You can also change the size here as well of your video if you want to make it smaller. I'm just going to click compress video and it will now compress that for you and download it automatically to your computer. Now I'm just going to drag that file into my page that I'm building. It'll automatically add it for me as a video. But of course I can now convert this using the block conversion tool to a cover block. Now it's a background image. You can change the focal point over here on the right. I'm probably going to change the opacity like so, but now I can write my heading over the top. And because it's a cover block, we can add other blocks within it, like the paragraph block and the buttons block. And we can align that button and do all the normal stuff that we can do using our cover block, like so. And there we go, we have a beautiful AI generated hero section. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, if you can hit that like button now, it would be amazing because it really, really, really helps spread the word of the channel. And also every time you do hit that like button now, our cats get a little treat. So thanks again for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button and you'll be notified every time I release a new one. Keep well, and I'll see you soon.